The 1st Special Forces Operational Detachment Delta, commonly referred to as just Delta Force, are a special operations force within the United States Army. They are the Army's equivalent of SEAL Team 6 and are tasked with counterterrorism, hostage rescue and special reconnaissance. The majority of those joining Delta Force come from the US Army Rangers, however this isn't a requirement. In order to join, it is claimed that you need to be a US citizen, be 21 years or older, pass a modified Class 2 flight physical assessment, have at least a secret level security clearance, have a minimum of two years remaining in their enlistment, be airborne qualified or volunteer for airborne training, and pass the Army physical fitness test. If you fit this criteria and are able to pass a rigorous pre-screening process, you will move on to assessment and selection. This takes place twice a year somewhere in the Appalachian Mountains and lasts a month and aims to take potential candidates to their physical and mental limits. Selection begins with a physical fitness test, including push-ups, sit-ups, runs and clothes swims. Numerous land navigation tests using map and compass skills are completed, including a timed 18-mile ruck march at night in which the candidate must carry 35 pounds in their rucksack and a timed 40-mile route while carrying a 45-pound rucksack over rough, steep terrain. In addition to these physical tests, mental examinations, psychological assessments, and interviews with instructors, psychologists, and the Delta Force commander. Following on from this, the candidates are informed if they've made it through to the next stage of selection. It is claimed that an average of 90% of candidates will not make it past the selection stage. Those who do move on to the operator training course. The Operator Training Course is an intense six-month-long course, during which the candidates perfect the skills required to be a Delta Force Operator. This includes marksmanship, beginning with stationary targets, moving on to moving targets, and ending up in a shoot house taking down multiple enemies in order to rescue hostages. Demolition and breaching skills, from lockpicking to advanced demolition and bomb making. Tradecraft. Candidates learn a variety of skills useful for their operations, including espionage skills such as dead drops, brief encounters, pickups, load and unload signals, danger and safe signals, surveillance and counter surveillance. Protection skills such as advanced driving and using vehicles as offensive and defensive weapons, and learning VIP protection techniques. And finally, combined skills such as setting up sniper positions, hostage rescue in a variety of locations such as aircraft. All these skills are put together for a culmination exercise, during which they need to apply all the skills learned during the operator training course. Only half the candidates who have reached the operator training course manage to complete it. Upon completion of the operator training course, the successful candidates are assigned to an operational position within Delta Force.